Okay, we're getting a much more expressive sound here. Uh, we started with a major pentatonic scale and then we used the same notes to create the relative minor pentatonic scale. So let's take that scale that we've now got, the major pentatonic with the flattened third, and use that to create a minor pentatonic scale. The new note that we're adding, that flattened third, actually occupies a different place in the relative minor. That new note becomes the flattened fifth. So we've got a minor pentatonic scale with a flattened fifth. And the interesting thing about this is that that flattened fifth is exactly a tritone away from the key note. So for you guys playing in D minor, D to A flat, that's your flattened fifth, that's a tritone. Don't forget the tritone is the interval that worried us originally when we removed the fourth and the seventh notes from the major scale. They were a tritone apart and that gave us a dissonance that we didn't necessarily want to have to deal with. But actually now we're reintroducing that tritone, albeit in a different place, to give us lots of expression. You guys playing in E minor, E to B flat, that's a tritone. That's the flattened fifth. For us, well, B minor, B to F natural, that's the flattened fifth, that's the tritone, and it's actually this. Okay, famously, that's the flattened fifth. And of course, you're free to massage the pitch of that note, move it up from the fourth, or move down to it from the perfect fifth. Uh, but you should really think of that whole area around that as an area of kind of indeterminate pitch with an elastic pitch that you can move any way you like. This pentatonic scale, the minor pentatonic with the flattened fifth is actually known as the blues scale. It's got such a familiar and versatile sound. Lots of people, guitarists particularly, play pretty much nothing but the blues scale. Here's how it sounds. There's my keynote. Okay, so that selection of notes really comes into its own when we shift the tonal center from being the relative major with the flattened third to the relative minor with the flattened fifth. And let's put that into our jam track. Mm -hmm. 